Hi there and welcome back to DMP Skoda in Wakefield. Today I'm going to be showing you around this fantastic 2019 Skoda Kodiak Sportline. It's a 2 litre diesel with 190 brake horsepower, the DSG automatic gearbox and Haldex four wheel drive system. And as you can see in velvet red, it's looking fantastic with all the black accents as well, complementing it nicely. I'm going to show you around it, show you some of the features. Starting with my personal favourite alloys that we do, the 20 inch Vega alloys. Very nice design, all four corners looking fantastic and plenty of tread left on all the tyres. You've got the black wing mirrors, black window surrounds, black roof bars, black lower skirts. You've got the Sportline badge on either side, privacy glass, uh, the filler cap on the right hand side as usual. As we move around to the back you can see we've got the individual badge lettering with the 4x4 badge there very nicely and if you open the boot you've got an electric tailgate and as you can see this is a seven seater car and it's just this easy to get the seats in place very very nice you've also got under here uh, storage for the parcel shelf when the seats are in and then here is where you store the seat belts when they're not in use very very nice then starting with the very rear seats, the rear two seats with the boot. As you can see, I can get in, leg room's a little bit tight. Headroom I've got enough of at six foot tall. So for short journeys, nipping from A to B very quickly is very handy to have two adults back here or indeed children will be comfortable for on long journeys, you may struggle with it back here. However, the front middle or the middle row seats, I should say, uh, it does adjust forward and backwards, giving room both for the rear passengers here and also the middle row passengers. Then this middle row seat is still set to how it was showing the previous seats. And again, I've got a decent amount of legroom and plenty of headroom. It's still very light in here, despite the dark headliner. You've got uh, three headrests in here, three seats here with a center armrest option here with two and a half cup holders, ice fix points in the left and right hand side seats. You've just got plenty of ample room and it's very comfortable and practical. You've got the nice Alcantara in the doors and on the seats with the half leather combination. Then finally, the front row seats for the driver and front passenger again, very comfortable, plenty of leg room. This driver's seat as well is electronically adjustable, height, fore and back and rear uh, adjustment as well. You can see we've got these nice racy bucket seats, very supportive with the fixed headrest and very nicely complementing the car. You've got the adjustable armrest here as well and the DSG gearbox lever just so. Steering wheel, very nice. You've got the flat bottom steering wheel with flappy paddles. You've also got adjustability with that so you can have it closer or further away, up or down. I personally prefer it quite close. Then you've got all the rest of the controls nearby. It's easy to reach the screen and touch all the uh, center controls for the um, climate control and all for the mirrors and lights and everything like that. Then to show off some highlights on this car, we'll start with the virtual cockpit so you can completely change what screen you have in the center and have a variety of them there. My personal favorite is any showing the digital map in the center and you can see just 38,979 miles on the clock on a 2019 car. You've got flappy paddles as mentioned, basic cruise control, automatic lights, front and rear fog lamps, electric boot release opening and closing, a Kessie system for the front doors, uh, keyless entry and the stop start on here. All electric window and mirror controls here on the door. Infotainment wise, you've obviously got satellite navigation, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto through SmartLink. You've got front and rear parking sensors and a reverse camera. You've got drive mode select and being a four wheel drive, you've got snow mode. However, this also comes with off road mode, which helps a lot better in well off road situations with loose surfaces like gravel or sand. Uh, what else have we got? You have obviously DAB, AM and FM radio and the usual Bluetooth connectivity. You've got a dual climate control system here with direction buttons and heated seats there. Then below here, you've got storage for your phone with a USB port. Then the gearbox itself, automatic, nice and smooth, knock into manual gears yourself. Then the drive mode select buttons and electronic handbrake there. Then storage under the armrest that can be used as a full storage cover or adjustable armrest. Being a Kodiak, you've got two glove boxes there, this being air conditioned and illuminated, and this one is lined with a rubber material to stop things sliding about. And finally, you've got storage for your sunglasses up here too. So again, another fantastic car, great example. If you are interested, please do feel free to visit us at Denbydale Road, Wakefield, WF27AW, or alternatively, give us a call on 01924 246 900. Thank you very much for your time. You take care now.